Hi guys, this is Ayakunle from Blooming Gardens. How are you guys doing today? All right, um, a few weeks ago, I said we were doing a trial of transplanting uh, already old and matured um, chili peppers. And I wanted to see if they would survive and um, they would start production. Okay, so, uh, well, the test, I would say, is very positive. They actually survived. Uh, but um, on, the, on the farm as a whole, uh we had to do some prioritization as you know we're in the dry season right now and um one of our borehole our solar system borehole packed up um that story for another day but um we we now had to rely on um two boreholes instead of the three so because of that we had to prioritize where we're going to send water to so what happened is that this project will have to be the four guys so we have to sacrifice uh, uh continuous uh, continuously watering here but even at that uh, uh let me just flip the camera but even at that look at this guy now he's one of the ones that we transplanted let me take out all these weeds so you can see them see it clearly right yep all of that is weed yep look at it already beginning to flower just about four weeks after transplanting this is another one you can see the leaves are all out now note that for the last two weeks we have not put any water here so the whole place is dry as in like dry look at the ground it's so so dry you know but the resilience of the chili this one is even flowered and produce some fruits it is more flowers over there you see they they survived that's the summary they survived the transplant so if we did not have the water issue that we had look at them yeah they survived they survived and not only survived the the ones that you really got established you see they're already flowering and ready to continue so would i do this again absolutely how are they able to survive this transplant? Definitely because of this uh, shade net. Because the shade net toned down the temperature here, the scotch of the of the the heat of the sun is seriously toned down. And uh, if we had continued putting water here, I am so sure. Because even look at look at this particular one now. For example, the vines are still a bit green. These were new plants, new shoots that came up. All these ones dried off, but new shoots was already coming up. So without a doubt, would I do this again if this scenario came up? Absolutely. Um, if you had planted uh, chili peppers maybe out in the field and for whatever reasons uh, you need to transplant to this kind of environment, would I could recommend it? Absolutely. So if I was to rate this entire project, I would give it an 80, 85, 90% score of success. Alright, so that's that for today i just wanted to give you an update because someone had asked me about a week ago for an update yeah we heard unfortunately we ran out of water so that's why it's not looking like uh, something i will be dancing about but i'm almost sure now manager you didn't believe that some of them would even start producing flowers though eh? yeah. can you see now flowers are producing if we had just maybe been able to solve the water problem or rainy season. yeah or maybe if this had been rainy season definitely would have just continued definitely but hey we know what we know now this is me ayokunle signing out i will see you on the next video